Well, welcome to the third in the series of, of algebra of uh, age word problems. And I just wanted to uh, start off where I left off in the second one. I, I got myself confused. You, you guys make me very nervous while you just sit there and listening, and I have to perform for you. But it turns out we did get the right answer. If you say Arman is 153 and Tarush is 765, then 85 years ago, Arman would have been 68 and Tarush would have been 680. And that, notice that's 10 times. So it worked out. So we're ready to tackle another problem. We'll do one more problem. Let's see. OK, now I need to type. To type, and I want to type big so you can see it. This problem says, Zach is four times as old as Salman. What a coincidence. Salman really shows up in a lot of problems. Zach is four times as old as Salman. Zach is also three years older than Salman. How old is Zach? Well, actually, this one actually seems uh, fairly straightforward. We're not dealing with the present and the future. We're just dealing with the present. So let's see if we can figure this out. So we're trying to figure out how old is Zach. Let's say Z for Zach. Z equals Zach. I don't like this big fat. Well, I'll stick with the big fat marker. Z is Zach. It says Zach is four times as old as Salman. Now I'm going to go to the thin, thin one. I don't like how big fat this is. So Salman, if Zach is Z, this first sentence, let me circle it. Zach is four times as old as Salman. So if Zach is four times as old as Salman, then that means that Sal is equal to Zach divided by four. Or, uh, well, I guess here yeah, we could just leave it like that. But then it also says here, let me put this in a different color, that Zach is also three years older than Salman. Well, if Zach is also three years older than Salman, so that means that also Sal would be Zach minus three, right? The first sentence says Zach is four times as old as Salman. Well, that means that if you take Zach's age and divide it by four, you get Sal's age. The second sentence says Zach is also three years older than Salman. So that takes, means if you take Zach's age and you subtract three from it, you get Sal's age again. Well, we have our equation set up. And actually, instead of writing Zach, I should have just written z. But the equation is all set up for us. And we get z over 4 is equal to z minus 3. You can multiply both sides of this equation times 4. And we'll get z is equal to 4z, remember to distribute it, minus 12. And then we just do, skip a couple of steps. And I get 3z is equal to 12. And I get Zach is equal to four years old. Let's see if that makes sense. If Zach is four years old, then this first sentence says Zach is four times as old as Salman. So that means Sal is one years old. And it also says Zach is three years older than Salman. Well, that's consistent. Four is three more than one. So we were right. Zach is exactly four years old. Hope that helps. Have fun. I think you're ready. You've now seen at least every type of uh, the age word problems. If you're still a little confused, you might just want to uh, rewatch the videos and, and maybe pause it right after I give you the problem and see if you can solve it yourself. And, and remember, you got a lot of practice problems that you can do on the actual modules themselves. Uh, have fun.